If you guys would like cheap and reliable MT, head over to NBAMTCoin.com. Use code BIO2K for 5% off your final order. What is going on, guys? It is your boy Bio2K, and today I'm bringing you guys a nice little triple threat prize pack opening video again for you guys. You guys killed the support on the first one, man. So let's try to hit 100 likes on this video again. Um, but yeah, first, there is going to be a brand new locker code that did come out today. Um, I think it was for MT. Um, I think like the highest amount you can get is like 20k, something like that. I'm trying to remember. Hold on, you know, I'm gonna go to Twitter real quick. You know what I'm saying? Like, let's just go to Twitter real quick. Yeah, it says uh, for a chance up to 20k MT. So I don't know how much that really is, but I'm gonna put the locker code up on the screen for you guys. I don't really know, like, I don't know, like, I don't really know how much 20k is really gonna be worth. But this is locker code. Feel free to pause the video if you guys haven't already. Um, the like punch in the code and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, so the most you can get is 20k. Um, the rest of the board's looking kind of eh. Like, I prefer it to be like 20k, you know, 10k, 15k, stuff like that. Like, I don't really think it's that big of a deal, especially at the end of the year. But, um, yeah, so unfortunately, we're going to get the 5k, which isn't too, too bad, I guess. It's like the second, you know, highest one. But that's what I'm saying. Like, I feel like that should have been at least 10k, like, for the end of the year. But 5k is pretty solid. If you guys take a look at the auction, I mean, there's so many opals that go for so cheap now. It's crazy. So, like... Realistically, if you guys get that 20k, I'm just gonna scroll over to 20k real quick and show you guys like so we'll just say 23k MT. You can get actually a pretty fair amount of opals. Like, yeah, they may not be like the best ones, but there's still free opals that you can get in this game. So if you were looking for, you know, a nice small point guard that would get bodied by all these new power forwards and small forwards and centers that people are running at point guard, then yeah, there you go, man. Look at all of them. I mean, I I don't think that there's probably gonna be a small forward that's available unless it's like John Havlicek, maybe. Um, no. Okay, power forward, probably not. Nope. And center, definitely not right. And yeah, there's that. All right, but you guys are here for the triple threat prize pack opening. Now, you guys see this and be like, bio, don't tell me you got all these golds, right? We got this day in history pack. We got this Kobe pack. And then triple threat was treating me very nicely the other day. We have two diamond packs, super pack, next gen, two more diamond packs, a Kobe pack, and another next gen pack. We have another diamond pack scrolling through. We have a draft pack, a throwback elite pack. We have a dual pack, another diamond pack, this day in history, another draft, another super pack, another diamond pack, another dual pack, and a coach pack. So this week, I think we're a little bit loaded. Um, last time we did this video, it wasn't completely as, you know, stacked. So we're going to clear out all these gold ones. I'm only going to show you guys the ones that actually give me badges in them because those are the only things that actually have value. All right, so here we go. We're going to go through these gold packs here. Um, you know, I'm going to show you guys the first one, and we do get a badge in Relentless Finisher. So that's a pretty fire start. I'll take that. Normally, like I said, when we open these, you know, they're not really, like, the best. So I'll take that. Like, see, like, Injury Car is not really looking forward to anything like that because they really are just quick sells. Um, honestly, though, my players have been getting hurt a little bit more. Maybe it's because I don't ever make subs. I don't really know. But yeah, my players have definitely been getting hurt a little bit more. I'll take the gold contracts, but that's obviously not why we're here. We'll open up this third one, hopefully get a badge. There we go. Defensive stopper. Okay, like, so, so far, relentless finisher, defensive stopper. Not too shabby, you know, not a bad start. We got some uh, interesting, you know, like, I'll take the contracts. Don't get me wrong, because, like, obviously, you can always use contracts in this game. But ain't nobody trying to get injury cards out here. Like, even if somebody does get injured, it's not like injury cards are scarce. Brick wall, another nice little badge to add to the collection. I'll take that. I'm not even going to be looking to sell most of these unless we get, like, limitless range or deep range or something like that. Or if I get a badge that I'm not aware that goes for a lot, dimer, I'll take. Um, but, yeah, if I get a badge that, I, you know, goes for a decent amount and you guys are like, buy like, sell it, you know, let me know in the comments down below so I know to sell it. Um, one last thing I did want to say, I did put up a poll in the, in the, uh, catch and shoot. Another nice one. I did put up a poll in the, um, community tab thing for my channel. Um, please be go, or please be sure to go and vote on that. It is something for rebuilds, which I know you guys were interested in seeing on the channel. So let me know. Rim protector, nice little badge right there. I'll take that. Like I said, we're actually getting a fair amount of badges. This is what I was looking for in the first one. I told you guys, these gold packs actually give you a solid amount of badges. There we go, another dimer. Like, this is what I'm talking about. Before, I don't know how we ended up getting so many, you know, injury cards and contracts and stuff like that because this is, like, truly what I was trying to get out of them. So it's actually pretty nice to see the fact that we're getting these badges again. Another defensive stopper. I will gladly take that. Um, we actually officially, you know, maxed out on that, so I'll take it. How many more gold packs do we have left? Two. All right, we have like a pretty decent amount. Well, we have like five or six left actually, but I'm actually excited to get into these promo packs, man, because we actually have a bunch this time. Another good badge. I will take that. Like, like I said, normally we don't, get, normally we're pulling injury cards and 
whatever the other thing is. I know contracts, but isn't there something else that you can pull? I don't think you can pull shoes from these. Um, but hey, this is actually not that bad of a start. So hopefully these packs can give me some heat. All right, that was our last gold pack. Now I do want to take a look. We're going to back our... We have 21 packs still to be open. So we have 21 really solid prize packs. I knew we had a good chunk stocked up. Like... This is actually a very nice collection here. We're going to start with this coach pack. This coach pack, I really want a bronze or a diamond. Nothing in between. The reason why I want a bronze is because they actually go for value because of the cheesy methods for 12 and O's. Be, be Lloyd. <sighs> that was Lloyd Pierce. That would have been fire. But you know what? This dude could actually have some value to it. You know, you never thought you'd see the day where you're asking for a bronze in 2K. Um, actually, no, it wasn't last year. The bronzes went for a crazy amount this year with silvers. Um, this day in history pack, we do get a ruby probably going to be, okay, Wilt Chamberlain. I was going to say Jordan, but hey, I'll take it. You know, it's a free 800 MT. We do have another one though, so I'm looking forward to doing that. Oh, wait, I, I put my hair the wrong way, bro. Unbelievable. And another ruby. All these this day in history cards that we've gotten, we've never once gotten anything other than a ruby. Actually, that's not true. We pulled an amethyst and we got that Bill Russell. Um, so, yeah, out of these remaining packs, I think the worst one that we can open is going to be the signature, you know, or not the signature, the uh, 20th anniversary packs. Because, like, you never get good odds in those. If we're being honest, the odds are always terrible in those. So we're gonna open this up and pull an emerald, like I did say. Um, we don't even get any good badges or anything. That's unfortunate. We're probably gonna quick sell. I was gonna say like half the pack. So we do get an emerald Vucevic right there. Nothing too too crazy. Uh, 20th anniversary Kobe pack part two. Maybe since we have two this time, maybe we can pull a little bit of fire. Last time we only had one, and we're gonna get another emerald. We get the Earn Timberwolves jersey, so those probably go for at least a little bit. Um, catch and shoot i didn't mean to send off but whatever i, I guess isaiah is going to the auction but now we have these super pack actually no let's do the throwback elite i think the throwback elite pack could bring us some fire maybe maybe not we're gonna get an amethyst so not really fire you know jameer nelson would be cool just because he pairs uh, eddie jones okay i'll take an eddie jones that works for me like literally you know my man eddie jones is a goat so why not add him back to the collection i think i quick sold him like a while ago just because obviously the value isn't too high but eddie jones obviously a very solid shooter um and yeah i will gladly take that so we have these super packs now that's what i think we're gonna go for because these super packs do have some pretty decent luck in them i do believe um we're gonna get a sapphire right away so that is young not really what we're looking for but hey it'll be a nice little sapphire to quick sell i guess if i need some random mt super pack part two hopefully we can pull a diamond we need to see something nice out of these you know another sapphire not what i'm looking for man when i was pulling these originally i thought they would be actually some fire fortunately not looking that way um i think oh we actually don't have one more i thought we did okay that's on me but we do have these next gen packs um the draft pack is gonna be we have two draft packs i didn't realize that so i think we're gonna do the next gen and then the next gen will work out best for us because the next gen packs are obviously very solid they have a decent chance of giving us something good and i lied because apparently we're just gonna get another ruby <sighs> all these prize packs bro and nothing goes for anything bro come on at least we have all these diamond packs though like that's that's at least a plus side you know what i'm saying like out of all these promo packs we should be able to get at least something you know what i'm saying um okay amethyst not really anything crazy but at least they're heating up like a little bit it's gonna be who spurs point guard yeah dejounte murray all right let's do these draft packs the duo packs are what i'm most hyped to open honestly last time they didn't really give us anything we get a diamond i forgot i'm an idiot bro i forgot the diamond the, the draft packs like the minimum is a diamond so that's kind of upsetting but at least if we get two diamond players out of this the first one's gonna be from the magic probably a power forward aaron gordon not too bad could be obviously a little bit worse but hey i'll take that you know aaron gordon nice little budget power forward you know if you wanted to add to your squad i guess you could do that you know what i'm saying but it is what it is you know like it's cool but like you're a quick sell buddy we're trying to get some fire out here and this is not really fire you know second draft pack though hopefully this can bring us some heat um gold gold silver okay don't be <laughs> bro it's literally like when you pull them off the board you're just not allowed to get anything good i know a lot of people were saying that you you know they've been pulling a lot of crazy stuff rick smiths over here um, I know a lot of people, like I said, were saying that they were pulling some fire off of these boards. And that is definitely not the case for your boy. Your boy is pulling straight garbage, you know? We we, we played like hours of triple threat, bro, for all this. I get quick sell, bro. You're a quick sell. All right, so we have all these diamond packs and we have the duo packs. I'm excited. I think I'm going to go with the duo packs first. At least we can end on a positive note with the contracts. Actually, no, no. We're going to save the duo packs. I think we're going to save the duo packs for last because just 
Duo packs seem to be the most clean sometimes. So with these diamond packs, all I wanted contracts out of them. That's a W. That is a W. That is not a, that is not an L. That is a W. So that's okay. If we're gonna get a shoe, I'd prefer it to be like that. You know what I'm saying? Okay, the RNC P3s aren't bad. I heard on Karolinko, like the pink diamond, it makes him very solid. So maybe I'll just start on him. Um, okay, see, that's garbage. That's not what we want. We started out hot. We're slowing down. Not what we need to be doing here. We need to keep up with the fire, not with the awful. <sighs> it just keeps getting worse, bro. It just keeps getting worse, my guy. You know, you know, we, we worked so hard, man. We worked so hard for these. Okay, there we go. That's all I need. I need to see one contract. It's like 25K. I'll undersell it, you know, because they sell faster, and I don't really care. You know, it's the end of the year. But it's like 25K, so that works for me. That shoe, definitely not what we're rocking with here. Final one here. Hopefully, we can get another contract. I'll take another, like, 350K. All right, the CP3, not too bad. CP3s aren't the worst, so I'll take that. But we have two duo packs left. Hopefully, they can be some fire, man. That is what I need. I need to see some kind of fire to close this out. Like, like that's not fire, bro. I don't care that it's Kobe or Eddie Jones. It, it's not. It, it's not either. It's Gail Goodrich. Last one. We need to pull something fire. Like we gotta pull something fire, bro. Please. I'm gonna. I'm gonna close my eyes. I'm gonna close my eyes. We're gonna go one, two. We're gonna go back to the middle. We're gonna go one, two, and then we're gonna go back to the middle. Now y'all know. Y'all know if we pulled something fire. Y'all know. In the comments, y'all are like, Bio! You suck! Bio! You pulled an opal. No cap, bro. I already know. We got a diamond. Oh, bro. Oh, oh no. I should have said opal, bro. Oh, why did I say diamond? I should have known better, bro. I should have known better. I should have just went with my instincts. That's awful, bro. Dave Bing, really? Honestly, this is like, I wanted this to be so fire, bro. We had so many prize packs, dude. We had so many, and I thought we'd be able to pull some, like, kind of heat. Like, literally, if you really think about it, our best pulls out of this whole thing were, like, badges. Like, that's, like, the crazy part. Like, we pulled some, you know, cool, you know, shoes, I guess. Like, you know, some of them will go for some value, you know, like this one I'm gonna put up on the auction, obviously, but like a lot of these dude, they just they just ain't it, bro. Like this CP3 shoe, I will take because I will put this on my Karolinko and it'll make him like, you know, at least somewhat comparable to the uh cheese ball that got released. Where the hell even are you, bro? Yeah. So we'll put him on him. So that wasn't a complete waste. I just like a lot of those dude, I really thought we would be able to pull some heat, like you know, the, the super packs, I didn't really expect much because, like, it would have been cool to pull some, like, actual, like, fire moments cards, but I didn't really expect much out of them. But out of, like, the duo packs next gen, you know, I expected at least one fire pull, so that's a little upsetting. But either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy. Prize packs are always fun. I'm going to just put this up as 10K bid. Um, oh, shit. I didn't realize it was going to keep going. I thought it was going to stop at 10. All right, I'll put this up at a uh, 10K bid. And kind of just let that do whatever. Contract, I'll just throw up for like, actually, because people might have been pulling it more. I don't know. I'll figure out the contract. But either way, like, I really wanted to pull some fire. You know what I'm saying? Like, I really thought we would be able to pull some sort of fire, you know. But it is what it is. Um, it's actually looking like contracts went up. Um, so, yeah, I think 25K is still the move. Yeah, I think I'm just going to throw it up for 25K. But yeah, I definitely thought we'd be able to pull some fire, so unfortunately we couldn't do that. Um, thank you guys for all the new subs and everything like that in the stream yesterday. Um, I hope you guys did enjoy. I hope you guys, you know, were having some fun in the stream. Um, again, for the stream last night, I appreciate you guys. Um, we still have a lot of opals to give away. I think I'm going to do a stream tonight on YouTube. And uh, yeah, we'll see what goes on from there. But either way, like I said... Um, if you guys are new, be sure to subscribe. If you guys haven't hit that like button yet and you guys did enjoy, hit the like button for your boy. And with that being said, I will see you in the next video.